hi everyone welcome back to my youtube channel is your baby girl mama what's up in today's video i'm gonna show you how i make this yummy butter cookie so stay tuned guys so guys to begin i have my 100 grams of butter you can also use margarine if you want so guys for this recipe i will be using mixer if you don't have mixer it's not a problem you can also mix it with your hand or you can use a spoon or stick toner you know whichever one that works for you is okay so that is it guys So next is to add in my sugar and for this recipe is 100 grams of sugar but for me I don't want it so sweet so I use 50 grams of sugar for this recipe. Okay guys whichever one that works for you is okay. Alright continue watching. So guys, after mixing, next is to add in one large egg. Next is to mix together. Make sure you combine everything together if you are using your hands or anything you are using to mix. Okay guys. So guys, at this stage, I will be adding in my all-purpose flour and the measurement is one cup. Okay guys, next is to add in a teaspoon of baking powder. If you want, you can also use vanilla extract, but for this recipe, I'm not using it. Some people use vanilla extract for their own, but I decided to use my baking powder. Okay guys, whichever one you prefer is okay. So guys, at this stage, I'm done missing the dough and this is how it's supposed to look like. This is how it's looking and this is what I need. Yeah, not too soft, not too thick. Okay, guys, take note. Not too soft, not too thick. So 
so guys at this stage i will wrap the dough with a solo fin after then i will transfer it to the fridge for about one hour One hour later. So guys, at this stage, the dough is ready and is out from the fridge. As you can see, next is to roll the dough out. And before then, I will sprinkle a little amount of flour on a surface where I'm rolling out the dough. So guys, at this stage, I will go ahead and use my cookies cutter to cut out the dough. This cookies cutter, you can get it in any shop where they are selling baking things. Yeah, I love this. It has different shape, but I love this love one. As in, my kids love the shape so much. So I decided to use it for them. Okay, guys. So guys, as you can see, this is the cutter and they have different types of shape. Here are part of the shapes. Okay guys, and if you are watching me for the first time, thank you so much for clicking on this video. Please, let's be friends by smashing that sign that says subscribe. Turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss out whenever I upload new videos like this. I normally upload videos on weekly basis. And to my OG returning subscribers, Thank you so much. I see you. I appreciate you guys from the deep bottom of my heart. So guys, I will repeat the same process until the dough is finished. So continue watching. So my beautiful people, at this stage, I'm done with the dough. As you can see, the next is to transfer it into my baking pan and bake in my oven for 180 degree for about 12 to 15 minutes until it is light brown. So guys, this is the final look of the cookies. It's looking yummy, crunchy, and tasty. Oh my goodness. Okay, I believe I've come to the end of this video. If you enjoyed watching this video, don't forget to like, share your thoughts at the comment section down below. See you guys in my next upcoming video because as of now, I am out. Bye. Ciao.